Here we are. Well, I bought a Blu-ray player the other day, and I decided I'm going to buy all the non-shitty Blu-ray players just so I can do reviews on them and stuff, because I can get them for like $15, $20 a piece, so why I can make that a big part of my channel. Okay, well, I got this so I can... Um, because I, I, there's different brands like Sanyo and, um, and, um, what's it called? The other one, um, uh, Vizio. And there's a lot of different older plays that I need to program. And I can only do it with this because I don't, all I have is Samsung, Sony, and LG remotes. I don't have any of that other stuff. And of course, this is, well, we got a scissor down here, which is a good thing. You can take the scissor. And you take it off of this, and we'll see what happens. Make sure you don't want to cut the manual. Because it's, um, this is what I hate, though, is that... How do they allow you to take like, something like this back? You don't want to ruin it entirely, because, um... If you take it back... Here's the codes for everything, see? Um... You don't... Oh, see, I even cut the manual a little. <laughs> Stupid me. Alright. Um... We're looking at Sanyo. Damn it. All right, Daewoo. I didn't cut it that much. So, okay. Um, let's see. Sanyo is going to be on here. Yeah, Sanyo. There's only one code for Sanyo. Hopefully, it, it works. Um, then we got... Um, yeah, there's all different ones for everything else. It's good that at least it came with the code. Some of them, they usually do, but whatever. And I guess this would show you how to program it. So that's it, and bye-bye.